Strategically located in the heart of the world's largest fish landing port, Dutch Harbor's Bering Fisheries is a primary processor and marketer of king crab, opilio snow crab, bear dye snow crab, halibut, Pacific cod, and black cod. Bering Fisheries is the only 100% American-owned and operated plant in Dutch Harbor and was formed through a partnership of industry leaders including regional native corporations CU Alaska, Copper River Seafoods, International Seafood Ventures LLC, and Pacific Harvest Seafood Incorporated. Offloaded directly from our fleet of commercial fishing boats like the Aleutian 1, live brown king crab are graded, weighed, counted, processed, cooked, frozen, glazed, and carefully true soldier packed and market ready in 20 pound boxes for direct delivery. Our unique process was pioneered by and is exclusively available from Bering Fisheries. Labeled Ultimate King Crab, Bering Fisheries ensures the highest quality and food safety with no broken product as often found in typical industry standard repacked and reprocessed crab. Our Ultimate King Crab legs average 10% larger than standard packed crab, provide 100% yield to the plate, and maintain great uniformity, flavor, color, and texture. While other processes initially bulk pack and then repack and reglaze for domestic retail and food service needs, Ultimate King Crab is handled just once live with all sizing and grading completed in the pre-packed stages rather than reprocessed from already frozen product. Our processing systems eliminate temperature fluctuations that happen during secondary processing and maintains our pristine condition direct from the plant to your plate. This also provides the highest possible HACCP food safety any supplier in the king crab category can offer. What we got here is the second step in the processing of king crab. This is called the butchering station. Go ahead guys. And what they're doing is just laying the crab over the butcher blade and separating the shoulders from the, and legs from the carapace. If they don't do this the right way, they can rip the legs off of the shoulders. Okay, what we have here is the um, third step and it's called the gilling. And if you look at this cluster right here, you'll see that the gills on the crab are still attached. The most efficient way to get these off is to rub it on this gilling bar right here. do that by just rubbing it on this rotating gilling bar and it'll rub away the gills. After it's gilled the crab are uh, weighed, size graded, and then the claws removed. Then it's going to come to the sectioning part right here where we're going to do the single leg production and we don't get any breakage when we do this. The key to this and making our packs have the right number of legs and the right number of, of claws is it's counted first over here and then when it's packed again it's going to be counted a second time to ensure that we get the right number. Individual legs weighed and counted to adhere to our unique specifications are carefully hand laid into baskets raw where they will remain as they travel through production untouched all the way through to the retail counter and end user kitchen. This is the cooking process of uh, king crab. This is a batch cooker, it's not a continuous. And we'll set it into this tank for 21 minutes at 210 degrees. If you don't cook it enough, the crab can turn blue. If you overcook it, the crab can be uh, rubbery and not have a very delicate texture to it. After the cook, the crab is put into an ambient tank or a cooling tank. And what we're doing is circulating fresh water through it. And we haven't chilled the water and we just want to stop the cook as quick as possible. After the ambient tank, we put the crab into this pre-chill tank. The water is chilled to 33 degrees, and we want to get the clusters to 35 degrees. If the crab's too warm when it comes out of this tank, 
it will absorb salt in the brine tank. So if you ever buy crab at the store and it tastes too salty, it's because it wasn't processed correctly and put into the brine tank at a warm temperature. In the freezing phase of, the, of our product, we put it into the brine tank. And what a brine tank is, is a uh, water salt solution, 92% salt, and we get the temperature down to minus two Fahrenheit. The crab will be in here from 35 to 40 minutes, and we'll bring the temperature down to minus two to zero degrees Fahrenheit. The last processing tank we have here is the glaze tank. After the brine, we want to dip the crab into this fresh water uh, tank, and we want to be able to develop a glaze around the crab. What the glaze does is it protects the crab from dehydration. We'll put on between five and seven percent glaze so that the crab is well protected for two years. As the frozen crab comes from its fresh water glazing cycle, it is removed from the basket, bagged, boxed, labeled, and transferred to cold storage where it can remain in excellent condition until ready for use. A paleo crab, also known as snow crab, comes in live from the Bering Sea. The three major processing differences of a paleo crab over the ultimate king crab is one, the cook time is shorter, two, we don't cut the sections up like we do with the ultimate king crab, and the third is we do a soldier pack. The primary reason for it is to prevent breakage while it's in transit. Therefore, when you get it, you're not going to open up a box and have a bunch of broken pieces of crab inside. just come out of the brine freezer. We put a 7% freshwater glaze on it. The glaze protects the crab from dehydration and gives it a shelf life of 18 months. We're gonna take this crab, remove it from the cage that it's in, put a, put a bag over it, then a box on top of that. It won't be touched by human hands at all and it's ready for market. Pacific cod is delivered directly from the North Pacific. It is headed, gutted, and the stomachs, roe, and milt are removed for secondary processing and custom orders. The cod is then size graded, rinsed, set on freezing trays, frozen in blocks, glazed, and bagged in 50 to 65 pound units for delivery to domestic and international markets. For seafood wholesalers and retailers, Bering Fisheries is your premium source for seafood products and processing. To learn more about our products and services, please contact sales at BeringFisheries.com.